All right. So uh, our group for our group question, uh, the given equation is negative x minus one to the power of three minus x minus one to the power of two plus sine x minus one is equal to zero. Uh, so uh, uh, in order to use the Newton method, uh, first we let fx is equals to negative x minus one to the power of three minus x minus one to the power of two plus sine x minus one. So we derive it and we get uh, f prime x is equal to negative three x to the power of two plus four x plus cos x minus one minus one equals to zero. So to the, uh, the given x not uh, the value is two. So uh, first we calculate the first iteration. Uh, we we substitute the the value of x not is equal to two to the equation of f x and f x and f prime x. So uh, when substituting the the value of x not, we get the f x is equal to negative one point one five eight five two nine, and for the five uh, f prime x not, we get a negative four point four five nine six nine seven seven. And to get the x one, uh, we just put uh, we just substitute the the value of f prime x and f f x, and we got x one is equal to one point seven four zero two 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 five. And then we repeat the same step for the second iteration, third iteration, and so on. Okay, after repeating the same step over and over again. You will get uh, this list of uh, value of x. First and foremost, we have been tasked with answering question 4. Line 1, 2, and 3 contain all the variables required to solve the Newton method equation. Line 5 contain the command f print f switch display all the variables in the command window. The loop function is then used to obtain the difference value of our stopping criteria which is si minus x bracket i minus 1 less than 0 0.001 we use the equation fx at line 7 to get the new difference value for line 8 the data is then displayed in the comment window we plot the x and y the graph for line 12, 13 and 14 by plotting the range of x and the equation of y to different graph in our comment we also turn on the grid, then we press the run button, and then the graph of our Newton method appear on the screen. Last but not least, the data as below demonstrate how to solve the fx equation by inserting x data into the function.